This story that happened, I guess it started what, three, weeks, three weeks two, ago. Two, three weeks. Joe Budden responds to backlash over scrap Tasha King interview. This is not going to be a long thing. I just put my pains on this. And I'm going to ask y'all a question. What is the responsibility of a person with a platform to talk to person they interviewed about whether or not their interview is going to come out or not? I think that's... Hold a- on. How much of responsibility does the person who runs the platform have to, to reach out to the interviewee when they're the interviewer? Go ahead. If I bring somebody on my... Tasha K fled to Africa. She came back. The lights kept going out. <laughs> I, For me personally, if let's say we were big and we had people we interviewed, which is never going to happen for me because I don't want to interview people. They're separate from you. That may be something that you want to do. I'm not putting you that on it. you. It brought somebody up here and we interviewed them and this person is, is controversy and we have attorney that we're, we're having look over the footage to make sure that we don't get sued. I'm going to keep in contact with that person after it's been a certain amount of time that, hey, we, uh, we're, not gonna, we're not putting out the video right now because I'm having my attorney look through the video to make sure that you know there's nothing in here that we can get sued over. And I will keep you up to date when we plan on releasing this video. Is that a bad, bad thing to say? Is it my like, responsibility to do that? Huh? Is it my, my responsibility? Yes, it is my responsibility. I brought you on my platform knowing what attention you were bringing if you, if, if you came on my platform. So, yes, I feel like I'm informed. Uh, Joe is love and hip-hop homies with Cardi B, too. But is, as, as a person who is my platform, when I interview, that's the interviews I don't put out. And I'm sure you let them people know I didn't put the interview but out. But if I'm planning on still releasing this, I don't need to tell you nothing. You need to keep me up to date. Because Why? he don't ever take that long to let any of, any of his other interviews be released. But what does it, me releasing or not releasing it, how does that change? That's, but you're going to a whole other different point besides the point of keeping in contact you know with saying? the person. If I'm going to release it. I need to keep in contact with you when I'm going to release it. What are you preparing? After a certain amount of time, you don't believe so? When are you, what are you preparing for when I release it? The, I don't know what I'm telling you for. Because this interview is going to bring attention. You, when it comes, you'll get it. Okay. The attention will come when I drop it. Cardi B going to have Tasha K on the blade. B better have money, LOL. And left my out, Travis, you need to keep me up. <laughs> yeah, you saying that. Yes, you do. I, that's something. If, if I am a content creator, me, and I'm saying, that I will keep somebody up to date. I'm not to reach out to somebody that I interviewed and said, I ain't putting out this content yet because you're controversial and I, I got a lot of attorneys look through this shit because you done said shit on here that might get me sued and I don't see the problem letting them know that. Maybe I'm just too humble. How's Sounds humble? like JP doesn't want to get sued. Well, what's the humbleness in What is the Because somebody. you're saying I'm a big platform. Why it's am not, I letting this smaller platform about, know what's going on? I never, I never said anything about Well, that ain't what you got to say to say it, nigga. Point of the matter is, if I'm not going to release it, I'm going to tell you. If I'm going to release it, no matter when I'm going to release it, I don't have to tell you to release it. Tasha can't afford to sue him. No, that's not what I'm saying. She's not going to sue Joe Budden for not putting out an interview. That's What I'm saying is, he's saying he has his attorneys combing through or looking through the video, so there's nothing in the video that Cardi B can come out and say, this is, uh, she's saying deflammatory comments towards me. Or is uh, culminating my character or something like that. That's what he's saying. I meant by Cardi B. Okay. Uh. But it is what it is. I mean, at this point, I think that the, the ship has sailed. He's not putting out the interview. Tasha K has gave out, come out and give her grievances towards Joe Button. And it is what it is. I think she he ain't got no respect for Cardi B. I think he has respect for Cardi B. For him not to put the video out, or, or sh- sh- there was some people that said, like Atlantic, because if he said, if he's an artist today, he was signed to what record company? He said Atlantic. Yeah, he said they do good business. Over Even there. though he's, he has dealings with these uh, record companies, I believe that they do reach out and say, this is going to make our artists look bad. Can't put this out. Using the word can't. You think they're asking him or telling him? They're telling him. Why would, he, why would they have control of his, uh, uh, okay. his platform? You don't, think that there's, you don't think there's no influence over his platform? You don't think... I didn't say influence. I said control. He don't control his platform. So it's 
not his weapon. When you reach a certain level, that's and you're true. allowed to reach that certain level for me, no, you don't have no control over your platform. So you're saying he can't open his platform. Like if we, from this, this to this, then then this audience should be looking at, at us sideways. Like, what the fuck is going on? Well, what did he do to say that he would ever... Okay. Well, person can't, said, we can't on this top long. It's not that important. It's not. But I want to just get this last thing out. Right. When a person has you on their platform, I feel like they, they have all the authority to whether or not when they're going to release that's it. A, that's absolutely true. When I'm going to release it. Now, if I'm not going to release it, I'm going to tell you. If I'm going to release it, I don't have to tell you when. Dude, if that's how you feel. That, if that's how you conduct and run your business, <laughs> then that's how you conduct and run your business. All right, man. But me being on the opposite side of this business, I would personally reach out to somebody and say, it's been three weeks and I haven't released it. This is why this is so. Because I want to keep that good relationship and not have the person think, oh, I haven't released this because Cardi B has called me and said, don't put this out. Type in Joe Button and Cardi B on YouTube. They not friendly. They not friendly, but she did do an interview with him on episode 45 when his podcast was named, I'll name this later. I'll name this podcast later. So she has been on the Joe Button network prior. I didn't say they were friendly. What I said is, uh, I believe that because they're in the industry, they tell Joe, you can't put out this interview because it's going to make Cardi B look bad. And she just released a single. Not going to be good for her. Thank you.